Hey sassy friends, Sandra here and it's that time of the month I show you what I have going on for the new release this month. This first set is called Balloon Alpha and it's absolutely one of my favorites. I love this alpha and I can't wait to show you guys all the cool ways that you can use this in your planner or for card making. This next set is called Munchies. I really love this set. I feel like it's pretty self-explanatory and it's so fun. You can put the little items in the girl's hand to make her look like, you know, that's your cheat day. And it's just so cute and you can use the items individually as well. So you don't have to use them together, but you can if you want to. Really love it. And then this next set, which is Pugtastic, <laughs> which is aptly named. I think it's so cute. And I think whether or not you have a pug, this is a really fun set to use for your puppy or for card making or just because you like cute things. So you're not going to want to miss out on this one. This next set is very functional. It's called Track It, but it's also very cute at the same time. You can build your own trackers as well as your own custom sidebars. And then you can also use the individual elements to just make really cute layouts. And you guys are going to see a few examples of that on the layout that I did at the end of this video. So stay tuned for that. The set also just features pre-made trackers as well. So all those little extra elements just help you further customize the tracker that you want or keep the one you already see there. This next set is called Happy Box which is aptly named. I love this set. It has all these cool patterns that you can create boxes with whether you have a planner, traveler's notebook, or bujo and you get all these little small elements that work really great together and you are going to see that in the layout at the end of this video as well because it's easier to see it than explain how freaking cute this is to make. This month's freebie was a spend 40 or more and you get this unicorn stamp set. It might be sold out by the time this video goes up since I'm getting the video up late, but usually I try to have something every other month as far as freebies go. I really love this one and if you're lucky enough to get one, then you're going to love it because I'm going to use it in this video and it's really fun. And of course you guys know I'm obsessed with unicorns, so what more is there to say? I'm using the bow pattern from the Happy Boxes set and I realized right after I pull this stamp up that I actually have to re-ink my stamp pad so don't pay any attention to that then I go ahead and stamp it in the sassy pink color which is still pretty good and doesn't need to be reinked just yet and then I'm going ahead and stamping the little headers that come in the same stamp because just so you guys can see how well they work together and how fun it is and I'm mixing and matching kind of like darker purples with lighter purples and then some pinks because those are like some of my favorite color combos in the history of the planet earth and I'm using some of the words from that set as well that work perfectly inside those little headers, the to-do, and then the little bows. I decided to just create my own bow checklist with the individual bow because once you add that header, it's kind of harder to, to line it up. And then I added the little girl from the tracker set. And then I decided to use the scallop um, little sidebar that I have in that set, which isn't really made to be used as like decor the way I'm using it. But that's the great thing about stamps. You can use them however you want. I stamped some of the ink on my acrylic block and then I used my water brush to kind of just color those scallops in just to make them pop a little bit more. And then I'm using the excess that's left on this block to kind of create like a faux splatter watercolor look just because I thought it would be fun. And you guys know I love mixed media and adding that to my planner so I figured why not. And then I'm coloring in this little girl with my watercolors just for funsies and because I think it's going to look really cute and you guys know I generally do this but you could also use color pencils and other things such as that. I will have links to all the products in the description box below for you guys. Then I'm also adding the little banner that is from the freebie unicorn set. I really love this little banner and I think it's really fun and functional and you can put whatever you want in there. I'm using a little bit of white out to cover the little top part of the end for the notes because I knew I wanted to cover that little area and kind of just make it match with the rest of my area. So I put a little paper that I punched out over it and then I stamped notes from that same tracker set and then that little heart from the same tracker set to just kind of make it look more cutesy and then while I was at it because I love hearts you guys know I need no excuse I just added them all over the place they just make it all cute then I just added the tracker as well. Uh, looking back at this, I could have just added the tracker and then left space to write exactly what I was tracking, like water or whatever, on the top part of it. But for whatever reason, I thought it would be fun to add the little cups because obviously I know that stands for water for me personally, but it could stand for coffee for you too, you know? That coffee life. And then I added the hearts and some other things there on the sidebar as well. So whatever works for you. Then I added the little hand from Talk to the Hand set, which was a 3x4 set I think I released like two months ago. And I really love the little hand from that. Um, <laughs> if you're not so much into that, you know, you don't have to use that one. 
but uh, I thought it was quite appropriate considering the subject matter for Monday. Now I'm just filling in the areas with whatever I have going on for those days. I don't always have a ton going on, but you know, I try. <laughs> I also added a little chocolate from the munchie set and a cookie because you know, that time of the month and cookies and chocolate kind of go together, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> then I added a little uh, character from the same set who is basically having her cheat day. I'm not going to say who that is, but it could potentially be me. And so I just went ahead and added the little bubble over it that says that just because I thought it would look cute But you could also use some of the words that come in the set as well Whatever works for you and then I went ahead and started coloring her in with some watercolors Just you know to make it all match up and to make it all look super cute But you could have also stamped her out on sticker paper and colored her in with your Copics off camera or colored her in with color pencils So there's so many options to use you don't have to just stick with one way of doing things I actually didn't film the whole layout that I did, but I will be showing it to you guys at the end of this video just for time's sake. I didn't want this video to get too long. Um, please be aware that in the description box there's going to be links to everything, including my website, social media, anything like that. Any questions you guys have, leave in the comments and let me know which was your favorite set that you saw today. Was it all of them? Um, if you want to see more sneak peeks whenever I do releases uh, beforehand, be sure and follow me on Instagram. I usually post most regularly there as well as the Sassy Club Facebook group as well. So I'll have links for all of that if you guys want to join the fan club over there. I'd really love to see you guys there and interact with you guys. And yeah, I really love the way this layout turned out. I'm obsessed with the Bubble Alpha, the bow prints, all the stamp sets and items that you see on this layout are from either current stamp sets or past stamp sets. So I'll try to remember to link anything that I used. And thanks again, thanks again guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more Plan With Me videos and all kinds of fun stuff. Thanks for joining me here and I will see you guys again soon. Bye!